So this is something that is important. I believe that everybody needs to hear this because right now the market is doing a lot of unpredictable things. All right. People need to remember that we've never been this high this early in terms of BTC. We've never been this high this early in terms of ADA. The market is in a vastly different pay, uh, place than what we normally experience this early on in the cycle. And that leaves a lot of questions. You know, the questions that people are having are, you know, are we going to continue this drop, right? Or as the data suggests, are we going to pop right out of here? Are we going to continue this run and set a new cycle high here? That's that's really some of the biggest questions, okay? And I have to say, right now is where a lot of people can get themselves wrecked, frankly. A lot of people are going to play games and say, oh, yeah, you know, we should drop down further. We might retrace to this 30 cent level, blah, 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 in the same way that people thought that 10 cent ADA was coming are wrecked as well. All right. We we don't know. We don't know with 100 percent certainty what direction we are going to head here. I do have to say I looked at the amount of USDT on exchanges again. We had we had the highest amount of net inflows just two days ago. We've seen in the last six months. All right. That is huge. There is a lot of capital that is flowing in right now, guys. And the thing is, is this money is all being positioned to buy. It's, it's a question of where it starts buying, right? We obviously saw some great news the other day, which was uh, the 19th that kind of started this, this run, right? Well, I guess the 20th. The 20th was kind of the day that started the run. And we got a nice pop here. We got a nice pop in terms of BTC, right? We saw all these great things taking place in the charts. And, you know, although that's happening, know that there is still the possibility of retracements. If history holds true, we may, we may continue to consolidate. We may drop and move further. But what if we don't? That's why me personally, I'm not playing games. I'm not trying to outsmart the market. Me personally, it's all been about accumulation for me, all right? The times to play games might be later on, all right? This is not financial advice. People can do what they want. But if you try to game the system here and you try to say, oh, you know, I'm going to sell at 62 cents and try to catch it at 40 cents or 30 cents and then it runs to 80, you're screwed. You're wrecked. You just lost 30% of your position. And that's the mistake that a lot of people are going to make right now. All right. The funny thing is, is when you sell, you push down the charts. Sometimes you push into other people's buying ranges. People, people don't necessarily think about that, right? They just think about, oh yeah, this is what it looks like is going to happen. And sometimes the market takes a right turn and goes the opposite direction. Now, what's kind of cool is obviously, you know, with, with indicators and stuff like this, they have a pretty good idea of what direction the, the market is going to head, right? Both these DCA plus opportunities here, both times we got a nice pop right after and some gains were made. If you guys are, again, are curious about checking that out, links in the description below. But remember, don't try to be smarter than the market. These things will play out how they play out. We know the timeline. We know what's happened historically. Right now, we're, we're still on pace for when things normally happen, okay? And it's possible that this could have been our retracement right here. This could have been our drop. We may consolidate from here. We may slightly trickle up. All right. Do we go lower? I don't really know. All right. The things that I'm seeing in the charts point more towards some bullish direction, but we'll just have to see how things go. So I appreciate you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't make mistakes here because these are mistakes that you will regret forever. So have a great day. Catch you later.